Hello, my name is James Stokebrand. This video will demo my RGB LED controller and node project. This is part two, showing the electronic parts in the PCB. Let's have a look at the raw hardware. These, this is the RGB controller and node outside of their enclosures. Uh, the controller will control the color and brightness and hue of the RGB LED. Here, let me do a quick software demonstration of that. This is hue. I push and release button one. I'm adjusting the hue on the control. I'm sorry, the node. Uh, when I push and release button two, we're in saturation mode where we change, adjust the saturation. And of course, button three, which adjusts the luminosity. Back into hue. Okay, let's have a better look at the controller node. Controller sys consists of a three board sandwich. Uh, the top board here, if we pull that off, consists of the three button inputs, the six LED display and the rotary encoder. Let's have a good look at that. The back of the board, of course, just contains the uh, LEDs for the the LEDs. I'm sorry, the resistors for the LEDs. The middle board consists of the debounce code or the debounce circuitry for the three button inputs and the rotary encoder, and a Schmidt inverter to make the nice uh, resistor capacitor discharges nice and sharp. This is a Atmel 3228P, AT Mega 3228P, and of course the status uh, LED. Get a close look at that. And of course the bottom part, the bottom board, which consists of the DC power plug, the on off button, the 3.3 volt voltage regulator. Uh, the programming header, the reset button for the MCU, of course a 9 volt and its power plug, and the Digi XB module that facilitates communication. Alright, let's have a look at the node. The node consists of a two layer sandwich. Let's pull off the top layer so we can have a good look at it. Uh, the top of the PCB consists of a common anode RGB LED. And on its flip side are the resistors that control the LEDs or allow the, uh, or the, or the, the condition the LED, the battery connector, of course, and the 3228P and the status LED. have a look at the bottom of the controller node. We of course have a DC power connector, a on off button, a 3.3 volt voltage regulator, the reset button for the MCU, the programming header, a four dip selector switch, of course the power and its connector, and a uh, Digi XB module that communicates between the two. Well, that concludes part two, displaying the hardware implementation of the RGB LED node controller. Thank you for watching.